Hi there, Casey and Jen here with another Fusion video. Today we're gonna start talking about special populations. Now, the Pilates studio is the perfect setting for people with all skill levels and abilities to come in and learn how to move their body more efficiently with less pain so that they can be stronger and move through space with ease. Now, uh, we have quite a few Parkinson's clients and Pilates is wonderful. Mm -hmm for not only Parkinson's, but uh, many people with different neurological disorders. Now, one of the easiest tools that you can use inside of the studio are springs and bungees for this. Because you're not just asking the client to feel where they're moving in space, but the springs and bungees give them a directional and where to move, and also it gives them cues visually of the quality of their movement. So let's talk a little bit about that with Jen using this bungee. So this is actually a pretty light spring um, you can use, and we like to stay a little bit on the lighter side so that we can get that nice full range of motion for them without them having to really brace themselves um, onto a heavier spring. So let's have Jen just line her body up, do a little bit more in internal rotation of the femurs, good, perfect. Now go ahead and just, you know, without really thinking too much about cueing, just press back into the spring and forward. So as Jen is moving, she can see where the spring is, right? And so somebody who has a harder time feeling where they're at in space or even controlling where they're at in sp space, this gives them an end game and a place to return to. Very, very important so that they even get a sense of where they're supposed to be. Now the other thing is, is the quality of movement that's happening inside of here is going to be reflected here. So Jen, if you could give me a little bit more unstable movement, you'll see a lot of this. You'll, they will see how erratic their body is moving, right? And so once again, we can use this to cue the body because it gives them a direct correlation with what's happening internally. So let's have you go nice and slow, nice and easy. Mm -hmm. Again, we can watch, even if you're using the actual springs with the coils, you can cue them to have the coils open uniformly and close uniformly. Very good, go ahead and drop that. Now, the other great thing is, you know, if you're just teaching mat and you don't have the springs and equipment, a TheraBand does the exact same thing. So Jen, if you could just hold. So same rules apply. We just have it tethered to one side and Jen's gonna be pulling. But again, they have this beautiful visual of the line of work they're moving through. Good. This is also really great to give people as homework. And it's not even about, you know, let's strengthen here or here. This is more about just fine tuning movement, kind of going internally, feeling what's happening and getting that visual sense of what's happening to see if we can calm the system a little bit, find a little bit more ease and grace in the movement. Go ahead and rest. Thank you so much for joining us and we'll see you soon. Thanks.